Good morning. Um, my name is Sefi, and I'm back here uh, with a package that I'm mostly justifying by writing a review about it online. Writing. Um, I seem to have misplaced my paper scissors, so we're using my pocket knife. It's been scrimshot. Uh, let's see. Uh, to update the last video, the rock that I misidentified as being tourmaline with quartz is actually tourmaline with moonstone, uh, which I thought was very, very interesting because that's my birthstone and it's also my sister's birthstone and it's still June and it's still her birth month. So I was pretty excited about that and I got so excited I went ahead and I bought her uh, some moonstones because they're, they just were so cute. I was playing with it at work pretty much all day, you know, when I wasn't doing work. Let's see, uh, this is a box this time uh, from Barking Moon Creations. It's the Witch's Brew Crystal Surprise Confetti. It's one fourth cup scoop and it's it was $15 USD and I believe that was with shipping and handling. And let's go ahead and open this up. Pretty excited because we have some nice daylight today and I have uh, what do you call this a light box that I that I've got that I'm using for light so hopefully I won't misidentify anything today let's find out let's find out together oh there's more tape I've already I've already punked myself I've already punked myself I've already also showed how old I am because I don't think anybody uses the word punked anymore. Bubble wrap. That's one of my favorite things. I think that's everybody's favorite thing. As for me for later. Oh, I think we got... Ah, we did. First off, organza bag. I'm very excited about bags every single time. I don't know why. Uh, here's the here's the business card. Thank you for your business. You're welcome. Please, please support small businesses. You don't you don't always need stuff from uh, the the big guys, or at least I don't. I think my boyfriend will enjoy this organza bag because it's green and that's his favorite color. Ooh. That's some really nice rocks. Let's see what's... Oh, we got another bag. A bag inside of a bag. I don't like pocket knives as much as I like my scissors, my paper scissors. I misplaced them when I was cutting open, I believe, dinner one night. Oh, my word. Um, this is a nice organza bag. It's got uh, moons and stars all over it. Oh, it's tied up. Probably the only criticism I have for any of these witches' confettis is that I don't think I've seen any of them with string that you can use. Oh, but here's a worry doll. Exciting. I don't know if anybody had any worry dolls as a child. Um, but you can tell them your worries and you put them under your pillow and then uh, they'll, they'll deal with them in the middle of the night. Oh, it's a rune, I think. That might be handmade. Some lavender. They don't send us very many, um, what do you call that, herbs. I definitely like herbs. Oh, that's very nice fluorite. This might actually be fluorescent. That's exciting. Amethyst. This, oh no, this is Chalcedony. Oh. I 
think that this is sunstone question mark sunstone is difficult for me to identify oh what's some more some more fluorite i certainly do like fluorite oh there's a lot of uh there's a lot of uh amethyst nice moon that's exciting what's this made out of venturine no i have trouble with green stones it's definitely a uh, weakness of mine. Is this dendritic, Jasper? Is this dendritic? I think it is. I like dendritic rocks. I don't have very many, but I like them all. Oh, rutile. I don't know if you can see those little flashes. Um, but rutile is usually what makes stuff um, cat's eye. That's not cat's eye. If it's in quartz, it usually doesn't. Or there's not enough. Listen, it's a sphere. I believe this is calcite. I like calcite a lot. It's hard for me not to like rocks. But I also really like these lavender buds. I have fresh in my garden. But that doesn't mean that there's no use for not fresh. Hmm, I can't tell if this is sodalite or lapis. And I'm not sure I care, because I have a lot of lapis. And not a lot of sodalite, so maybe that's a good thing. Chalcedony. Chalcedony, chalcedony. Fluorite. I need more fluorite. Oh, that's nice. This is some really nice rocks. They're a little bit quiet, and I'm not sure that's a bad thing. Sometimes quiet rocks are nice. Because it means you get to talk to them. And they won't yell at you. This is an oddly shaped stone. I, I like it. This looks like feldspar of some variety. Feldspar, quartz, chalcedony, which is quartz. There doesn't seem to be all that much glass, which is pretty exciting. Oh, this is definitely adventuring. I suck at uh, identifying green rocks so badly. I'm lucky that I know that this is. This is. I just said it. I'm lucky I know that this is uh, fluorite. Lots and lots and lots. I think everybody likes amethyst. I think everybody does. Excuse me. I know I do. I like amethyst. I like um, chalcedony. I don't like... Um, I don't like some rocks as much as they deserve to be liked. I wonder what this room is supposed to be for. I'll figure it out. Sometimes the most important part is figuring it out. Let's see. Lots of rocks. A little bit of this and a little bit of that. I'm glad that we got a carving. Two, I guess. Let's see. How would I rate this? They want you to rate it out of five because, I, I again, I've been buying all these off of Etsy. They want you to rate it out of five, and I'm terrible at that. Um, I would much rather rate it out of 10. I feel that a 10 system is, is more accurate. Oh, some more rutile. Um, 10 out of 10. Would buy again. Got some rutile. Got some carvings. Got some fun, weird, waxy. Actually, what's that on there? I don't know. Weird. Um... Feels like gossamer. 
compressed spider web. That's not a bad thing. Again, I would like to see more, um, what do you call that, string, uh, more very small uh, tools included in these, which is confetti. I think that would be useful. Not that, not that lavender isn't. Actually, I should smell this. Tell you how it, oh, I don't think this can be opened. I need a, oh no, here we go. Very lavender, very lavender, very fresh for dry lavender. It's very nice. It's almost like it's been perfumed, but I can tell that it hasn't. Anyways, 10 out of 10, would buy again, but we're not going to buy from these guys. We've bought several, uh, several of these from other companies, and hopefully those will come in. And I'm definitely justifying it by reviewing it online. I'm definitely doing that and not being silly. I don't know what you're talking about. Um, this has been Sefi. I've, uh, I hope that you get half as much enjoyment out of these silly objects as I am getting out of them or anything, anything that you get today, uh, or see. Let me know, uh, if you had anything fun that you purchased. Uh, my next video might be a pause from these because a friend of mine wants me to review Gashapon, but I haven't found any Gashapon I like. Um, I'll see you next time, and good day.